January 22nd, 2023. Let's do a tour of the lower floor of the Buddha Hall. So we're coming in the entrance that faces Gotami House. Coming up here on my right is the elevator shaft. And we'll start our tour by heading to the left. So I just walked through the uh, entrance. Here, I'll turn around so you can see that. And going down this corridor, we have three offices. Office one is here. Office two. And office three, a much bigger space. Let's go in and take a look. And heading down the hallway. The next room we'll go in is the media room. So this room is going to be set up uh, similar to a university classroom. Starting from about, I would say, this second set of windows to the back of the room, there'll be tiered seating. So the, 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 the desks will be on rised levels. I think there's seven uh, risers. And this will allow us to have teachings online from various teachers around the world, like Yeshitabke. The screen will be up at this end, and it allows us to have teachings just given in that room for whatever topic is being addressed. And then it'll also be a place where someone at the Abbey who's invited to speak can give a talk um, to an audience that has requested it from somewhere in the world. Okay, going down the hallway. The opening coming up on my left here is the vestibule. So this is um, an exit and an entrance that will likely be used just by the resident community here, not by our, our guests. This will be the women's washroom. Right across the way will be the men's washroom and now it's gonna get quite dark. And there's quite a bit of an ice and floor here. In the far back corner where that piece of wood is leaning, this will be the laundry room and the sewing room. And that will come out to about here where the hydronic heating coils are, these red coils. And then this area that I'm in right now, this will be storage space. And on my right here, it's quite dark, so we won't take too much time in here. This will be for the HVAC components. In the far corner, at the very back here, will be a room It hasn't been framed off yet. Oh, it's completely dark, so we'll go this way. It'll be for the fire suppression system. Okay, now we're entering the room that will be a meeting room just off of the library. Um, so this will be a place where we store texts that will never be signed out there, likely in the quality of being precious or rare. So let me turn around so you can see a good size of this space. And the entrance to this room, this meeting room off of the library will have a glass door. So it'll be a lovely space. Now we're in the library. And in this corner here, just to the right of the um, sawhorses, will be a little library office. Let's see. In this area, there'll be stacks of books. And over here, let's just take a look at all this window space here. In this area, there'll be places like study carrels, chairs against the windows. So it'll be a very lovely, well-lit area of the library. And then over here, from the windows on, will be more stacks of books either floor stacks or stacks of books on carts, on carts on wheels. Then, going this way, I missed two rooms, so we'll go back out of the library and go this way. And this room, just to the left of the library, is a meeting room, again, a very good-sized room. 
and heading this way. Another good sized room, and this will be the AV room, and this is where we're going to house all of the components that run the AV system upstairs and down. And it'll also be a place where the people who are doing video editing will work and um, do that kind of work. It's very exciting. The framing work has gone very quickly and we're very excited about the next steps coming up.